You may hear the word sofa and couch used interchangeably in everyday life, but is there actually a difference between the two? We spoke with a number of designers to find out at the end of the day. However, you should feel free to use whichever word comes most naturally to you. The terms are commonly accepted as interchangeable by most people. As designers say, though, sofa is a more formal piece primarily placed in a living room or family room, while a couch is a casual, lounge-friendly piece that belongs in the bedroom, office, or library. Is that a sofa or couch? A couch or sofa? How can I tell the difference? These are easily some of the most frequently asked questions we get from customers. The truth is, many in the furniture industry, particularly in North America, use the terms interchangeably with sofa being the more professional term. However, there are a couple slight differences between sofas and couches. Sofas are more formal and have prominent backs and armrests. Sofas are for sitting. On the other hand, couches are less formal and are more often used for lying on. Our goal for today is to cut through the industry jargon and provide you with a better knowledge of something we're passionate about here at WFMO. Furniture. Below, we'll dig into the definitions for each term and their history of usage. Once we understand where these words come from, it's easier to understand the differences between them. What is a sofa? The term sofa is a Turkish transliteration of the Arabic noun safa, which is a bench or raised platform meant for sitting or reclining. Traditionally, a sofa would be draped in fabric and adorned with cushions. True to its origin as a bench-like piece of furniture, sofas have well-defined arms and back. In addition, sofas are usually upholstered. While you can certainly recline on a sofa, they're primarily meant for sitting. As such, sofas tend to be more formal and are perfect for the living room. What is a couch? To be honest, there aren't too many differences between sofas and couches. The biggest difference is their intended use. The term couch is a derivative of the French verb coucher, which means to go to bed or lay down. Based on this early definition, couches are clearly meant for lounging about. In other words, sofas are meant for sitting while couches are equally meant for lying down. Lastly, while a couch may indeed have a defined back and two armrests like a sofa, it doesn't always. A couch may have only one arm or none at all. Given this fact, Couches have a less formal appearance and are most at home in the den, bonus room, or man cave. Placement of each piece varies. If you're wondering whether sofas and couches should be styled interchangeably, designer Kristen Rivoli of Kristen Rivoli Interior Design weighs in with some advice. You would generally use a sofa in a main living area or family room where you're sitting with a group of people. She notes, a couch would be used in a bedroom, office or library where you'd like to lounge, read a book or sit less formally, usually alone and not in a group setting. It isn't a surprise that couches are generally tucked away. After all, as Rick Lovegrove, president of upholstery at Four Hands points out, the French term coucher literally means to lay down and sleep. Overall, though, it's safe to say that no one will question you if you use these words interchangeably, particularly if you are speaking to an individual outside the design industry, determining which piece is right for you. Determining whether a sofa or couch is most suitable for you simply depends on the type of space you are furnishing. A sofa is best for a formal living room while a couch is ideal for the basement or playroom. When you are shopping online, retailers may still use these terms differently than how the designers above do, so it will be helpful to search both words to ensure that you don't miss out on any fabulous finds that may have been labeled one way and not the other. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment. Thanks for watching.